filming? I have, yeah. First, we'll talk to you about you guys going around recording. Can I just get your name first before we start the conversation? My name is Eva. Okay. okay. And do you have a guard ID number? Excuse me? Don't so you me. guys cannot be up here? How's it going, everybody? Watching The Watchman here, out with Amagansett Press, here in Las Vegas, Nevada, here at the Clark County Library. Uh, I don't know if you saw our video at the Clark County Government Center. So, uh, we'll see if they learn their lesson here at Clark County, or, uh, if they respond the same. So we'll see if the information about our First Amendment rights will spread over across other uh, areas of county facilities. So if you like this video on what we do, make sure you hit the like button and subscribe to my channel and Amagansett Press's channel on YouTube. And if you want to see the titles and thumbnails of new videos, the day before they come out here on YouTube, you can follow my Twitter and Instagram. So let's see how it goes. Ready to watch me? Yep. So we have the uh, dedication plaque here. So it looks like this building was dedicated originally in 1971. And then there was a major renovation completed in 1986. All right guys, let's head back inside. There's a sign on the door saying no uh, dangerous objects or weapons and stuff. And I just remembered I had my uh, pocket knife so I left it in the car see no dangerous items Exactly is reader services. Does that just encompass anything? Are you filming? I have, yeah. Okay, I'm pretty sure there are certain rules about filming. You do know there are certain rules about filming in the library. I don't, no. Okay. Do you have a copy of them? The rules about filming the library, what does it say I have to make all you guys look good? Or? No. No. <laughs> Um, basically, you can't film with other people, especially without their permission, is the thing. So, really? It, yeah. Well, this is called the Okay. Yeah, drop it or? Mike, Mike's in here. Okay. Yeah, if you have a copy of the policy, I'd love to look at it so I'm familiar with the rules. Alright, one moment. That'd be great. Yeah. Sorry, it's not, not against it or whatnot. I just have to. No, no, I don't think it's personal. Yeah. You're, just, you're doing your job, I get it. Thanks. Cool. What is his or her name? Mike. 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 Okay. This is a pretty cool uh, library. It's going to be interesting to see what the uh, rules are. Policy. I feel like the manager is the security guard. <laughs> <laughs> I 
right, so there's a handicap sign over here. I guess you can roll a wheelchair up if you have one. Normally it should be near the front floor. Because I looked around when I came in because I always like to check for that stuff and I didn't see anything. So. And what was your name? T. Jason. Pleasure to meet you, sir. This is my son, Ben. Ben, nice to meet you. Hey, guys. You must be Mike. Yes. How you doing, Mike? Hey. My name's Jason. Hi. Pleasure to meet you, man. Nice this is my you. son, Ben. Nice, nice to meet you. Um, so, what you guys want to know? Oh, so we just came in, and I actually, I, we go to libraries all the time. I'm okay. an avid reader. I've been at okay. my library card since I was a kid. Okay. Um, and we're just in Vegas for a couple of days. Haven't been here before. Okay. So I was asking T. Yeah. Um, what the... Uh, uh oh, this guy's putting his gloves on, man. He's gonna get me nervous. Yeah. 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 What was that your intention? Yeah. Oh, okay, good. Glad to hear. Right. Um, so yeah, no, I just have never actually noticed or seen a reader services section in the right. library before. So right. I was just coming in to ask what that was and what services are provided here. Um, that was just it. to go with the just the recording though. First is um, just not recording any people that don't want to be recorded. You have to respect the privacy. How would I know if they want to be recorded or not? If they tell you they don't want to be recorded. In public, really? Yeah, if they don't want to be recorded. Because, and I'll tell you why I'm just okay. taking a pause there for a second, because what we do is we go to, we travel the country a lot. Right. And we go to a lot of uh, public buildings. Okay. So we make very sure, I'm very aware of restricted areas, and we okay. make very sure we don't go into restricted areas. Okay. But my understanding is, which I could be wrong, okay. is that when you're in a public setting, there is no expectation of privacy. So that's why we like to stay in publicly accessible areas. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, understandable that it's just, um, getting into people's faces if they don't Oh, I wouldn't do that. Their, no, no, like, no, I wouldn't. Their personal no. space. And also, this like is that. a very wide-angle lens. I don't know if you know how okay. GoPros work. Okay. So, I'm not focusing on any person. I'm here to look at Basically, the building in the library. Basically, the reader service is just, uh, we provide readers advisory for people. We press uh, place items on hold for people if they request for books. Requests from other libraries. Requests from other libraries. Or if I'm like looking that. for a book on photography, you can tell right. me find show them where they are. We uh, <laughs> tell them um, uh, the resources available for them to uh, find out other books that they would like to, to uh, similar to the ones that are reading gotcha. through our website and through the various resources that we um, make available in our databases. Uh, different programs and events that the library uh, makes available for people. Cool. And the free services that are provided to them. Gotcha. Um, well, that's cool that you have a counter dedicated throughout, to Throughout that. the Las Vegas area and then as well as what the library district offers. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. well, very cool. Yeah, that's, that answers my question. Very cool. Awesome. Um, so no, and like I was saying, we de I'm not interested in filming anybody in particular, that's not right. what I'm here for. But it's kind of like the analogy that I use is it's kind of like when you're in a public, like let's say you're in front of the, the uh, strato, whatever they call that, and you want to take a picture of your kids and there's a thousand people behind right. them, you know, you can't go ask everybody for their permission. And then right. I also feel like if I walk up and start that conversation with somebody, that could right. create a problem. Yeah. So I kind of just tend to no, it, mind just, my business. It, it's, just, it's just the more of like... Oh, I would like, never do yeah, that like that. that. No. Yeah. I don't want somebody to snatch my phone. It cost me <laughs> right. a lot of money. Yeah. <laughs> right. we don't no, but no, I wouldn't do that. Okay. So as long as we're not getting in anybody's face or intruding on anybody's privacy, we're right. okay. All right, good. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm on the same page with you. All no right, worries. Very cool. uh, we'll give you the fist bump. <laughs> right. Thank you, Mike. We appreciate right. you. Take care, Thank guys. you, sir. Uh, no problem. All righty. That means we're friends now. We moved up to the fist bump. <laughs> All right, buddy. Thank you. Thank you. No problem. <laughs> Computer center in the back. Oh, no, that's cool. Oh, wow. Quite a few computers in here, huh? Pretty cool.
Hello. Hello. How are you doing today? Good. Good. A lot of computers in here. Yeah, 40. 40? Yeah. Wow. My name's Jason. Alex. Alex, pleasure to meet you. This is my son, Ben. Nice to meet you. So we're just a couple of tourists traveling around Las Vegas. Okay. And we like libraries. So. Oh, do you? Yeah. The first thing I, mean, or I did when I went to San Diego was look at their library. Yeah, we do that all the time. Yeah. yeah. I've had a library park since I was a kid. That's awesome. I think it's a very, even with the internet and all that stuff, it's a very useful resource. Oh, right. And we come in and speak to people like yourselves and get help. Okay. Yeah, yeah. it's nice. Yeah, it is. I, I enjoy learning a lot, too. Very cool. Yeah. And you get to work at one. I do. Awesome. So you love your job. I do. Very I do. cool. How long have you been working here? Um, here? Yeah. Uh, two and a half years. Or for a library. The district itself, six years. Oh, cool. Yeah. Good for you, man. Yeah. Right. Well, we appreciate your cordial demeanor. That's very nice. Yeah, and it's yeah. a nice welcome to your city. And we appreciate you. Of course. All right. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your stay here. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Well, have a good day. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, the library rules of conduct, let's see. Is that the computer rules? No, just the rules of conduct for like the whole library. Oh, oh it is? Yeah. Really? What does it say? Yeah, I don't think it said anything about taking video. That's interesting. I didn't even see that. So let's see, library rules of conduct. There you go. So you guys can hit pause and read this if you're interested. So the only thing that I see that comes close is disruptive use of electronic or communication devices, but I would assume that that means talking on your phone too loud. Uh -huh. But I guess you could construe or misconstrue that to be a phone uh, camera. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I don't see anything about film. Cool. Good to know. And again, if anybody wants to read that in detail, just rewind, hit the pause button, and check it out. application and some other public information here. Yeah, same thing, right? So music, DVDs. Here we have music. I wish I could like call somebody every time I feel uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Cool. Yeah, bookstore. Can't bookstore. actually have you guys like hanging out in this area though. Oh, not hanging it. out. We're just freezing through. Yeah, yeah. like sit. I was gonna check out your bookstore. That's fine. Yeah, yeah it's just this area is um eight uh twelve to eighteen. So he's twelve to eighteen. <laughs> <laughs> he's sixteen. Okay, right. he can then. Yeah. Well, I'm his father. I'm one of them. We're just, no, but seriously, not yeah. to give you a hard time. We're just yeah. gonna breeze in and out, and I'm not gonna hang out. Okay. All right. Um, just no recording of the children, of the kids. I. Okay. I have no desire to specifically record any children, Mike, okay. so no worries. Okay, thank you guys. Hello. Hi. How are you? Hi. Little oh, bookstore. Cool yeah. stuff. Yeah. But my name's Jason. May I ask what your name is? Uh, Jessica. Jessica, pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thanks. <laughs> this is my son, Ben. Ben, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm sure you think libraries are very interesting places, and so do we. Mm, it's just nice. Peaceful. Yeah, it is. Um, and even in this you know, age of internet and all that kind of stuff. There's something nice about coming to the library and talking to people and getting information and advice and that kind of stuff. And yeah. Yeah, it's nice. We appreciate what you do. Thank you. I've had a library card since I was a little kid. I get a lot of use out of my library back home. We're from Colorado. Oh, okay. So, That's really cool. Yeah, so we were in Las Vegas for a few days, and so let's go check out the library. Okay. Yeah, so, cool. Let's go. Cool.
Francisco. You're kind of hard, don't Fiction and romance. Is that two different things? Kidding. Uh -huh. Kidding. Kidding. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys. Have a wonderful day. Yeah. Have a good one. Be at the park. You guys? Kind of funny. You said it's the school. We have a park around here. That they, have a, they have a park around here that they have a uh, butterfly sanctuary in. Thousands of butterflies. Okay. Um, I'm trying to get her. I can't. I'm drawing a blank on its name. What, what? Oh, I can Google it. But so there's a butter right here in Las Vegas. Yeah, yeah. And it's you go in and they like land on you and stuff. Yeah, and yeah. Oh, very cool. That's cool. Your cameras and stuff. Yeah. Excellent. No, it's a good tip. Yeah. I appreciate that. And they have a wonderful coffee shop there. Oh, now you're talking my language. Yes. So they have a great coffee shop. It's just uh, it's on Durango, I think. <laughs> okay. Just over here. Um, I can't. Okay. Oh, these days with the internet, I'll find it in two seconds. Yeah. But I appreciate the tip. Yes. And what was your name? Local school there. I'm a local John Yarbrough. John? My name's Jason, John. Jason. Pleasure to meet you. I'll give you, give you the old fist bump. There you go. <laughs> but if you want to go, and they have plants from all over the world, all through the park. That the, I bet you they have butterfly bushes. Yes. Yeah. And they have the butterflies and they have the coffee shop. So if you guys can find it, you should go. That's very cool. that's where the locals go. Cool. Not no, that's a great tourists, tip. But the locals go. And we try to stay away from where the tourists go. So that's yeah. you're talking to the right guys. Yeah. That's why we come to the library. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody, no tourists come here, right? Well, you're not a local, so they no. might charge you to get in. But if you're a local, you can probably. Walk. That's all right. You know what? If we use the facilities here, I don't mind contributing a little bit. Okay. That's fine. Um, you know, I was going to ask you. Being that you're a local, do you have a car. Yeah, sure. Do you have one of the born in Nevada plates? Yeah, sure. So that new design that they did is oh, awesome. No, I love I, those I, plates. I don't. I just have the regular plate. Oh, okay. So you got to get yourself yeah. one of those Born in Nevada plates. Everybody wants them. <laughs> yeah, I think it's a great design. And it's the same, you know, the hockey team was playing last night, and they have that same. Yes. Yeah, it's a great yeah. image. Yeah. Well, thank you very much, John. Thank I appreciate you. you. Well. Have a good day, young lady. Thank have you. a good one. All right, so just blast through here real quick. So this is the, uh, doesn't even look like there's any kids in here. No kids in here, right? All right, uh, cool. All right, so that means we can have a little table. I'm just trying to, we spoke to Mike. Oh. Uh, he just asked me if I could to try not to film any of the kids. So there's uh, no kids here. My name's Jason, by the way. Uh, How are you? Uh, this is my son. Ben, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Very cool library. Uh, I'm one of those strange people that actually enjoys the library and likes it. You know? <laughs> Pretty cool. It's not like the old school. I used to take the library back in the day. No, it's not. Just books and. Everything. Well, you you don't even remember my day. Back in my day, you actually had to go through the index cards and microfiche and all oh, that stuff. Oh yeah. yeah. It took you an hour and a half to find a book. <laughs> <laughs> and the library. Let me tell you something. Back then, you had to fend for yourself. If you went into the library and asked the librarian where a book was, she would point at the index cards and say, "Go so find it." Like, oh wow. So, yeah. Because they wanted you to go through the motions and do the actually, work so you could learn how to do it. Right. So it's just saying, yeah. Right. Right. yeah. Yeah, we had to work a little more for things when I was a kid. These days, everything's a little... Right, we'll, we'll take any more of your time. We appreciate your help. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'll just take a quick buzz around here. We'll be out of here. Thank you. This is cool. Do you run the children's programs here? Yeah, uh, it takes time for this. Uh, it's, it's affordable. It's first department, but it's... Um, He's on this uh, coordinator, much of the I'm titled here, he's on the maker space person. Okay. So, um, and then making our department so we can like, figure out different programs and stuff. So we do the theme days, like the day is science day. It's usually based off steam, so it's like you science one day, technology, art. Got it. So uh, each day just goes. So and this is not little kids, this is teens, right? Yeah, teens, 12, 12 to 17. Believe it or not, he's 16. So <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah, yeah. So 12, in 12 17, so you'd be able to come in and um, in 18, you're still in high school and have your like high school ideas. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. The thing is, as long as they're working on something productive, like like they want to play games and stuff, that's why they go to the lounge. But they actually work on something. Right. right. Yeah. So the smarter kids come in here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. I, I wish I was smarter when I was that age. I would have worked a little harder, you know. But I saved it up for now. Now I'm working See, on there it. See, there you go. Hey, as long as you use it, you know what I'm saying? That's it, man. Well, all right, buddy. and I just want to tell you, your smile and your cordial welcome to the city is beautiful, man. I mean, we really appreciate it. It makes a difference. Oh, you guys coming off the road. Oh, yeah, no. Very nice. Okay. All right. <laughs>
I'm stuck in front of him. No, the KSI is pretty cool. I know. Like I said, the KSI didn't seem really like it, so it was nice to have like... Yeah, no, it's awesome. You seem like a fun guy to do this. Oh, yeah, it's great. It's cool being around him. Good for you, man. Yeah. Right on. Never gonna Public work service is a good thing, man. Yeah, I guess it's needed, so. It is. It's needed, but you know what? Good people are needed. Yeah, that is true. Yeah, so we appreciate you. Oh, thank you. I appreciate All right, it. All right, man. Thank right. you. You guys have a good rest of the day. Have a great day. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, okay, nice. Have a good one. Very cool. And then this is another room for uh, the kids here to cool. do their stuff. That's cool. That's true. If any of you are uh, young people out there in your teenage years, I wasn't kidding. Work hard now, and then when you get to be my age, you can take it easy. Are there other floors? I don't yes. know. Yeah, that's a good question. Back in a thousand, nobody's upset. Um, are there other floors or just this one floor? There's three floors here. There's three floors, okay. So is there an elevator, stairs? Uh, there's an elevator right across straight through there and there's stairs straight through there. Alright, cool. cool. I'll take the stairs. My watch likes it when I take the stairs. <laughs> uh, what was your name? My name is Gabe. Gabe, Jason. Yeah. Nice to meet you. This is JS? Yes. Okay. Yep. Yeah. 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 You guys figured this out already, huh? Mm -hmm. That was quick. <laughs> yeah. But no, good. So, I mean, so far you guys are... Uh, Place is wonderful. We just had a nice conversation with Al back there, and he's yeah. You guys are. Mike was very friendly. And you just got to be careful filming children, you know. And uh, well, you know what? I'm with my child. This is my son, um, and I have no desire whatsoever to film children. But I mean, if they're in the room, they're in the room kind of thing. But I'm not looking to film even adults. I'm not look, looking to film anybody in particular. We're more looking at the building and the library. And the building. That's all. Well, we appreciate you. Thank you very much for your help. All right, buddy. Oh, there's the uh, thing you're always talking about. Oh, the Vegas yeah. born thing? That's cool. Are you born in Vegas? Uh, no, but I've been here most of my life, so. But so you, so you can't get one of the born in Vegas places? It doesn't matter. You can be here. If you get a bride here today, you can get that car still. So. Oh, no, no, but I mean like the license plate for your car. I think that you have to be born here, right? Oh, really? I didn't know that that yeah. was the thing. Yeah, I think no. so. Yeah. But I wasn't born here either, so don't feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, buddy. Thank you. Have a good one. Take care. He's actually more uptight than Mike. Yeah. Alright, so that's uh, first look. Oh, well, some letters fell off. Now it just says tear instead of stairs. Yep. Let go of the tear. Now, now I sound like News Now California. <laughs> the uh, Constitutional Rain Man. You want to go up the tear? Oh, that's what it is. This is the second floor. The lower level's down there, and there's one above, too. So let's too. go to the third floor, and then we'll go all the way down. Cool. To the third floor. <laughs> Hi, Hello. How are you? Good. No, we're just actually looking at the building here. Cool. And since this is the kids' area, I'm going to take a very wide view and head back down the stairs. Um, but my name's Jason. This is my son Ben. Okay. And we've just never been in Vegas before. Cool. And we're one of those. I'm one of those strange people that actually loves libraries. Libraries are fun. Yeah. Feel free to take a look around. Cool. But it's a kids section, so make it brief. <laughs> Yeah, well, that's why I brought my kid with me. <laughs> no, we'll just, we'll, just, we'll just breeze in and out. Oh, I'm sorry, what was your name? Christy. Christy, Jason. Pleasure to meet you, Christy. Nice to meet you. Appreciate you. Thank you. So there's a nice room for the young kids up here. Some movies over here. Some computers for the kids here. Oh, I remember these magazines. Wow. These have been around forever. Wow. Why do you have 
Some printers, that's cool. Lots to do. Uh, nice view out the window here. Yeah. Nice. Oh, that's cool. That's a nice view. Very good. Hi, how are you? Sure. What are we talking about? Oh, we're going to talk out here. Oh, we're going to talk out here. Okay. Yes. I know you guys have already spoken to about you guys going around recording. Can I just get your name first before we start the conversation? My name is Eva. Okay. okay. And do you have a guard ID number? Excuse me? I said do you have a guard ID number? Allied Universal. Feel free to call them. Alright, so guys. What's the attitude about it? Because if you can have an attitude, I have nothing to talk I to you have, about. I'm discussing with you. Keep interrupting me. So. No, that's not the case. I'm going to just continue Hi. what I'm doing. So going. you guys cannot be up here in the children's party without a child? I just was. So you're wrong. How about that? Call security, Mom. Wow. Can you come by for me? Why would you want to create a disturbance in the situation? Is that what your training tells you to do? Um, can you meet me in the main lobby? Wow. Thank you. So we were on the second floor, all right? Yep. Young lady? After you? Yeah, this is the main level, so. So we're going to Lower level. So we're going to be one in the crowd. You take your time, young lady, no rush. So let's see what's down here. Cool. This is a nice one. Yeah. Very cool. World Atlas. What's the lady's name? Is all the way upstairs on the third floor that I shook her hand? Christy? Something. Was it Christy? Was it? I don't know. Because yeah. she's the one that said, you can go ahead and look around. Yeah. Even though we don't need that sort of mm -hmm. affirmation, but she did say that. So we have a reference desk. Some tax forms, cool. Schedule A. Tax information. I guess they offer assistance here. Oh, you... Some, uh... Newspapers from around the country here, very cool. Oh, magazine section. Very cool. They have a lot of magazines. Yeah. I know, right? Which way do we come in? Over here. What's uh, down here? Restrooms, career call, center, one stop, payphone, phone. theater, cool. Check this out. They got a lot. This is a classic case of the left hand doesn't know what the right hand's doing. Uh -huh. you know, they should kind of talk yeah. to each other. Newspapers here. For copies of newspapers. They say photocopy. Yeah, nobody really cared until uh, security came up trying to make an issue out of it. Ridiculous. Well, that's what they want to do. They want to create a disturbance in a situation and blame you for it. Yeah. Security guards are worse than police. Got a little Adult learning program. program. This area is closed, so we won't go in here. Some job postings. Cool. 
They have one stop career center. And this is restrooms and telephones, so we'll skip the restroom area. Yeah. I kind of got to use the restroom, but we're going to get accused of uh, trying to film yeah, in there. Wait yeah, I'm going to wait till we leave. Go ahead. I can hang on to your camera. But... No, I'll wait till we leave. We can stop somewhere after we go. This area may be under surveillance. Of course it's under surveillance. Interesting. <laughs> and I didn't give my permission to be on film. Can't be recording upstairs. Well, that's funny how the person who runs that children's room on the third floor just invited me to take a look around. I know. So that's, that's uh, interesting. What a power trip. Yeah. Do you see the way she, she was, excuse me, when you asked if she had an ID number? Excuse me? Excuse me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. As if you asked for like your social security number or something. Yeah. Well. Well, that's about it down here. Okay, that's this floor. It's a lot of security for a library. Well, it's a shame that's what they have to do with themselves, you know? Mm -hmm. Oh, they have a conference going on over here. <laughs> Code red situation going on? Sorry? Is a code red situation going on? I'm not that sure. Good. You guys really need to, uh, like, okay, so the left hand doesn't know what the right hand is. Sure. Let's go. Wow. You guys should have become cops. You're much more suited for that. Thank you. No. Well, I was having a nice day until you disrupted it. You, uh, maybe go get an education. Unbelievable. All right, we're gonna get out of your hair. I just want to come say thank you and take a So you were the first person I saw for you to be the last person I see before I leave. Okay. So thank you again for your no assistance. Problem. And uh, the only suggestion I would have maybe you want to mention to Mike is. Because you know, we spoke to Mike, he's the manager of the library. Right, we spoke to uh, yourself, we spoke to a couple other people, we've been having nice conversations with people all along. And then security just came out and started yelling at me. Like they had no idea that I had had a conversation with Mike or what the situation was or that we had come to a meeting of the minds. So it might be a good idea for the left hand to know what the right hand is doing because that whole situation could create a disturbance in itself and then I wind up getting blamed for it when I didn't even know. So. You know, I it's a library, you guys don't need disturbances going on. And it's, it's only a camera. Right? And I'm with my son. And we're just uh, having a good day. So I hope everyone else is, and I thank you. You've been very cordial. Tell Mike I said the same thing, and I didn't meet you, but my name's Jason. What was your first name? My name's Tess. Tess. Yeah. Pleasure to meet you, Tess. Nice to meet you. Thank you so much. You have a beautiful smile, so no, thank you thank for that. Thank you. Alrighty. Well, you guys have a good day? Yeah, you we too. We appreciate you. Jason. Right. Thank you. I would really seriously, just maybe somebody should have a talk with security because they were out of line. In my opinion, my humble opinion. All right, guys, thank you. Bye. Thank you. Have a good day, young man. I appreciate your assistance. Thank you very much. Have a good one. Actually, we, we went back there, right? That was the bookstore and... Yeah, yeah, we went there. That was where uh, Al was. That's right, that's where Al was. Okay, cool. So we saw him. That's cool. Digital book return or something. The funny part is he asked me if this was the first amendment order. I told him what we were doing and they still sent security on us. So I still didn't even send security and she just took that upon herself. Security just decided uh, to spaz, yeah. yeah. You know what, I'm gonna, let's go find those security guys because I want to get some names and... Uh, That'd be a good idea to just, I don't want to say file a complaint, but just let somebody know that that was, a, that was what we had to deal with. Uh-huh. Last time I saw them all, they went that down that way. 
don't know where he is. Did you just like jump behind the door hiding? <laughs> wow, this is some strange stuff going on in this place. Huh? Wow. You know what, just really quick before I leave, is, it, is Mike still available? Um, did you want to talk to him? Yeah, if he's still, just for a minute if he's available. Thank you. Call him Michael Marsteller? Yes. Hey, Mike. Um, you guys need to do a little bit, I guess. Seriously. I'm at the start desk. You guys Thanks. can get friendly if people come into the library, don't you think? I'm sorry. Did I have a conversation with you? Uh, did you have a conversation with me? Sorry? You guys have got a code red situation going on? I'm not that concerned here. No, no. Have I, even have I ever words have to you? I ever met you before? No. No. So, so I guess why not, are you no. discussing this with me? Oh no, I didn't ask you a question. I have no idea what you even speak of. Yep. <laughs> really? Let's shift this thought. You shouldn't be walking around with a badge and a gun if you don't remember what happened to me. You shouldn't be walking around with a camera. Alright, Mike, so, right, Mike, so we're going to take off and get out of here. Right. I appreciate it. Thank you, Scott. Um, but I just want to let you know, when you and I had a meeting of the minds, we had a conversation, I respected your wishes, you know, we kind of mm -hmm. got on the same page. Right. We walked around, we went uh, met, went in the back and met Al, there were no kids right. back there at the time. Okay. Um, we went up to the third floor, which I didn't even know was the children's floor, and when yeah. we went up there, one of the ladies behind the desk, I think it was Christy, Yeah. okay, Christy said, oh no, you guys are good, you're free to look around, right. do whatever you want to do, so we did. And then as we're leaving the third floor, these three guys come upstairs and literally were obnoxious, uh, telling us to get out. I asked the woman to identify herself. She looked at me like I had some nerve to ask her who she was. Yeah, it, um, nothing against you guys. It's just because of the things we usually deal with this library, instances in that. Um, we usually, when it's usually suspicious when adults go up and hang out there. So they really weren't sure. Well, he's not an adult. They, I know, I know. Well, they see you, and they really didn't know it, so apologize that happened. Okay, no, that's and fair that, enough. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's fair so enough. They and all I'm yeah. asking is, it's not in front of me while I'm here. I'm not looking to belittle anybody, but after yeah. I leave, if you have an opportunity to speak to these guys in private, maybe just let them know that they, they, they have a responsibility. And I don't think it's funny, sir. You're working in a public building that my tax dollars pay for, okay? So I think that they have a responsibility to have a certain protocol and a certain demeanor with the public, especially when I've already cleared everything with you and you're the manager of right. the library, I understand? Yeah, it was... They saw they saw you up there and they they weren't they just saw adult an adult up there and, and I guess that and they that. And they, yeah. and they have every right to right. do what they um, feel they need to do in the performance right. of their duties, but you have to remain cordial and you have right. to have some level of decorum. Yeah, you can't just start off, snapping yeah. at people and being obnoxious and walking away. And I, All I said to her was, I said, before we start the conversation, can I just get your name? She said her name and I said, can you tell me what your guard number is? And she went, really? Like with an attitude like mm -hmm. that, like I'm not good. And then started barking orders at me, so I just turned around and walked away. Barking, uh, barking orders as a... To get out of the child section. Okay. And she caught us as we were walking out anyway, so she okay. was telling me to do what I was already doing. Okay. So I just think that action and that behavior could instigate something. See, the problem is once things start going up, it's hard to get them to come back down. Right. So right. de-escalation is very important. From the and these guys, to Well, and these guys are trained in de-escalation, so they need to put that into practice. There's no reason to have attitudes with anybody. I didn't even have a conversation with you. I didn't say two words to you. Is there a kind of code red situation going on? I'm not that concerned here. You didn't say two words to me. All right, but look, look at how upset you are. Just, just smile and let your shoulders down and smile, man. I'm not the bad guy. We're not here to cause you any problems. All right. So, and when I leave, I, I hope we can shake hands, have a smile, and say have a great Absolutely. day. That's all it is, I mean, yeah. I mean, I never had a conversation with you. You keep referring to me. I don't even know what's going on. Well, because I wanted to speak to the young lady that works with you, and she just turned her back on me and walked away. So, since you walked out, I said, hey, maybe I can just ask this guy we, real quick we, what we the issue was. We will have a conversation. Yeah, I would just, that's all I would we suggest. It's just my humble suggestion. Absolutely. But, um, we, we appreciate, I appreciate it. No, and you were very cordial, and I appreciate that, and I think, I like do, I said. I do my best. Well, that's all, that's all any of us can possibly uh -huh. do. I'm not perfect, man. I right. do my best, too. And, you know, if I make right. any mistakes, I love people to point out what I do wrong. Right. And it gives me an opportunity to do better tomorrow and grow and be a better person. I'm looking to educate myself as well. That's right. all. Yeah, right. that's it. Well, and I think you guys are probably a couple of real nice guys, and you're just looking out for your library, and we get that. And, right. But I think that you have to kind of just evaluate the, the threat level a little bit better next time. That's all. Because I'm not a threat to anybody, we, neither is my son. Well, it, that's that's why we have to determine. You know, that's why they call us just to make sure it is not a problem. Right. Upstairs. 
Well, what's the, what's the what's the key to security? Observe and report. So observe is the key, right? All right, but I appreciate you, man. All's well that ends well, right? Thank you, sir. More than welcome to come here anytime. Excellent. Thank you so much. Oh, I'm doing the tea again, man. All right, guys, you have a wonderful day. Thank you. I do that with everybody. Oh, you know what? I hear you. I hear you. All right, buddy. Thank you. And I'm glad you're leaving with a smile. Have a great day. Appreciate you. We're not. They're not supposed to. I hope you have a wonderful day today, seriously. And before I leave, do you think we could both like put our shoulders down and just end this on a happy note? Because uh, that's all we're... Oh, no, sir. I'm those girls with the big shoulders. I'm perfectly fine. Oh, okay. I'm just trying to be cordial, but this is my son. Right. We're just the first time we've ever been in Las Vegas. We spoke to Mike and some of the staff before we went through the building and they were okay with it. So when you came upstairs, I was just, I thought we had discussed and handled all that. And when you came up the way you did, it kind of just took me back a little bit. And since you're working in your official capacity, I wasn't trying to give you a hard time, but when somebody in law enforcement or security or an official capacity approaches me in that situation like that, I just ask you to identify yourself. And you have a policy that requires that, so that's all we do. Right. This is a First Amendment order. Right. Do you I don't know any, if you're aware of it. Do you have any questions, sir? Yeah, I do. Would you like to, any of our programs or resources? No, no, my question is, is are you going to start opening up and listening to people and maybe expand? You're a young lady and you have a long career. I am, and I have a lot to do today, so if there's anything I can help you with, please let me know. Otherwise, I would have you to can, You can help me. Okay. Yeah, you can, you can definitely help me. I wish you would drop the attitude and just lighten up a little bit. I understand what you have to deal with here at times, but that's not us. So you have to be able to compartmentalize and treat people the way they deserve to be treated. That's all. And I have all the respect for you, and I, I just ask you for the, the same thing. I am an advocate of the First Amendment, but right now, this is just inappropriate. It's taking me away from my duties. I apologize. Please let me know if I can do anything for you guys, okay? Very good. You have a wonderful day. You too. Wow. No hope. I had a very good friend back in New York years ago who always used to say, some people know and some people never will. All right. May, look, Friday and Sunday, they, they close that panel. All right, guys. Um, that's the Clark County Library for you here in Las Vegas, Nevada. All right, guys, you saw how that went here at the Clark County Library in Las Vegas, Nevada. Uh, make sure you let us know what you think in the comments. And uh, not much else to say. I mean, you saw how security handled the situation and uh, the rest of the staff. So, that's about it for this one. If you like this video and what we do, make sure you subscribe to my channel and Amiga Suppresses channel on YouTube and hit the like button on this video. And if you want to see titles and thumbnails of new videos the day before they come out here on YouTube, you can follow my Instagram and Twitter. That's about it for this one. Watching the Watchmen, Amiga Suppress, coming to you from Las Vegas, Nevada. Out. See you in the next one, guys.